They are very demanding when it comes to performance of the equipment, reliability of the equipment, but also regarding some factors like uh, weight, uh, compact design, and especially energy efficiency, which is more and more a key factor in the public transportation sector, where ABB has a lot of uh, technology to support them. Such a train is an excellent example for uh, our commitment to sustainability, public transportation, efficient use of energy, but also innovation. This train is one of the most powerful trains of this kind, running in a very uh, challenging environment over very steep mountains with the state of the art of technology, very compact. We have seen this train has all our equipment underneath, so all the space is left for the passengers. That where our technology also drives the development of this industry and we can demonstrate that uh, greatly here. This uh, rail business really perfectly fits uh, some global trends like uh, urbanization, uh, mobility, mass transportation uh, and also more energy efficiency in the whole sector. This business has developed greatly over the past few years. We started with a few hundred millions uh, some 10 years back. Now we just hit the 1.5 billion border and I'm sure this growth will continue and support ABV strategy. <music>there is hardly a better reference than if you can prove that you can cross the Alps climbing up to 2300 meters above uh, sea level uh, later on to show to the Canadian customers for instance that you really can deal with this low temperature and with these harsh weather conditions Swiss market later on is here for us to create the respective reference that later on we can be successful in the international markets. We really have also the right ground that we can test our technologies. This project helps observe us as a reference also to go later on to the international markets. If you can prove that you can cross the Alps, climbing up to 2,300 meters above the sea level, then for sure this reference fits perfectly also uh, to get uh, further projects in, for instance, Scandinavia. And of course doing these under dry conditions with nice weather, that's one, one point, but doing the same thing, the same track also during, uh, when you have harsh conditions during the winter period, then even you really can prove that you deployed a stable product to the market. The engineers from Staller as well as from ABB, that they are really working directly together. I mean, this is a straight point-to-point -point discussion. So it means together they are going to work out the best fitting solutions. We are not just talking about basic specifications, we are really talking about solutions. And this makes a difference. This is the only way the Alps is the perfect test ground to test different climate conditions. I mean, when we are up on 2,300 meters, then you have deep winter conditions and then descending to Italy down to Poschiavo. Two, two hours later, uh, you have rather a Mediterranean climate, you know, so the temperature will rise up from, from minus 10 degrees up to 15 degrees or something like that. And this is really, you can, uh, within just one test run, you can simulate uh, a lot of different conditions.